the Breeders Cup Juvenile Dirt is next, another small field. Uh, seven runners this time. These two year olds going over a mile and a half a furlong on the dirt. Animal Kingdom, Dan Hughes, Blitzer, Joshua Sullivan looking for a three timer. Serunos, Padraig Hogan, Cork Typhoon, Paul Rhodes, El Paso, Latak, Vinnie Gerard, Victory Bond, Martin Lidman, View the Alley, Darren Thompson. Just seven. There's definitely an argument for amalgamating some of these Breeders' Cup races, I think. It needs to be looked at in the closed season. All installed and ready to go. And away they go. The grey closest to us, View the Alley. And the leader early on there is Serunos. And that one has gone into a two length lead from Cork Typhoon on the outside second. And the other grey, Victory Bond, who's wide on the track. And View the Alley with the back three, probably the big three. El Paso, attack Blitzer and Animal Kingdom. But it's Cork Typhoon who's got the lead. Now by about two lengths as Serunos just held back into fourth as the two greys go past him. But it's Cork Typhoon for Paul Rhodes clear by three lengths. To Victory Bond and View the Alley. Serunos is next then El Paso attack. I saw Paul Rhodes bemoaning the fact that he could only get one horse into the Breeders' Cup this week. Well, I've noticed him running at least four, so I don't know what he meant by that. He must have meant one of the big races. Maybe he meant the Breeders' Cup Classic or something. But anyway, it's Cork Typhoon in front from Serunos in second. Victory Bond third. Then El Paso attack is fourth. View the alleys after that one. Then comes Blitzer and Animal Kingdom is the back marker at the moment. They've only got three and a half furlongs to go and Cork Typhoon is four lengths clear of Serunos in second. Victory Bond is in third. El Paso attack on the outside of that one. Fourth. Then comes Blitzer going up the inside. That one's now starting to make a forward move as so they come down towards the final two furlongs and it's time to say go I think and Cork Typhoon has gone for home. Serunos has gone in pursuit so to Blitzer El Paso attack Victory Bond winning a big race on the inside Animal Kingdom of the Alley haven't picked up yet as they come down towards the final furlong and now Blitzer blitzes into the lead it's Blitzer that just sweeps past Cork Typhoon as though it's not there and he races into the final half furlong and Blitzer is going to take this one pretty comfortably indeed up towards another grade one for Joshua Sutherland Blitzer takes it Cork Typhoon El Paso attack Animal Kingdom Victory Bond was next and Joshua Sutherland running away with the Jumps Championship. He's had his fair share of Group 1 flat races this season as well. I think he's easily the dual co champion if we still have such a thing. Blitz is the winner though for Joshua Sutherland. Cork Typhoon, Paul Road second. El Paso Latak for Vinnie Gerard was third. Animal Kingdom, Dan Hughes fourth. And Serunos for Padraig Hogan was fifth.